Josh, first, first game as an Illini, how do you think it went? I think it went really well. I think it went really well for the, the team, the offense, and the receivers. And I feel like we made a statement. You know, winning 42-3 to three is obviously a good morale boost, and now the standard is higher for the next game that we're playing. So. What well, statement do you think you made? That we're a high-powered offense, and that we can beat you either running the ball or throwing the ball. You know, and that we have a lot of talent on the field, and that everybody's uh, everybody's willing to do their job, and we're going to be a force to be reckoned with. So, is this the kind of offense that, if it has to, can just outscore people? I think so, personally. I really, honestly think that we could have put 60 on the on the board. Like, I mean, we just kind of like throttled it down a little bit just because there are some injuries mm -hmm. and stuff like that. But I think that we really could have put 60 on the board. So there's a shootout. You guys can, you guys can win. I think so. But I don't even think that's going to be necessary. Our defense is showing that they can almost shut people out when they three points on the board. You know, and the defense played extremely well. We had a couple of turnovers too. So I think that. It's going to be good on offense and on defense this year. Josh, all six of you transfers really played well today. What do you think you guys proved as a unit? Um, as a unit of transfers, uh, I just all of us have like a chip on our shoulders, you know. And not only to other people, we want to prove to ourselves that we are the players that we believe ourselves to be. And all of us doing that obviously will make the team better. So we're, we're uh, thankful for the additions we're able to make to this team. What was it like to play with Brandon today? What was that connection? Like? You guys marched right down the field right away. Yeah, no, for sure. I mean, the, the connection is still being built. The chemistry is still being built and stuff like that. I'm starting to learn what he wants. He's starting to learn what I want. But it's great. It's exciting. I feel like we're scratching the surface and I can't wait to see where we're going to go. Trayvon, is, you guys came from the same school together. Yeah. You're out there on the field together. What's, what's that like for you two guys just being back on the field together again? Yeah, no, it's it's amazing, you know. And uh, I was so happy for Trayvon when he scored his touchdown. That was his first touchdown, and I felt like I scored the touchdown, you know, because I just I seen the pain that he's gone through over these last couple of years, and just to kind of see him start to really actualize his potential a little bit, it's 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 gratifying for me. Did you, you almost got your foot in bounds too on, on your touchdown, uh, right? Like what happened there? Yeah, no, so um, I tried to swim the guy and uh, he had held me a little bit. So after he had held me, I was getting my arms repositioned to catch the ball, but it like came right then. So I bobbled a little bit and then my, my right leg was out of bounds. So didn't catch that one, but it is what it is. So. What will the emotions be like for you when you get that first touchdown? I couldn't even tell you, you know, but for me, I know I'm not satisfied with a touchdown, you know what I'm saying? I have high aspirations for myself. For me, that would be the beginning of something great. Thanks, Josh.